So here you are. This is behind where we live. Look at, look at this little one here. Look. Yeah, that one. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Little beauty. Now, these haven't got running water in wherever it is they live. And they come to this pump here, look. The water's free, yeah. They don't. But, do you know what? They're living in here. No, the water's not clean, and you can imagine all this water. All this is seeping into the water supply. Um, now, I don't consider that we live in bad conditions because we don't. We've got running water. Our place is clean, and at the end of the get day, guys, when you shut that door, you could be anywhere. You know, and I love the fact we're around this. This, I love this. I mean, I really do. You know, and the kids, they're just so happy. Because kids know no different anyway. I mean, look, they're playing with... This is... <laughs> Are you American? Am I American? No, no, I'm British. Hello, hello. So family is king. And while these people's got family, they've got everything. Even though they've got nothing, you know, uh, material wise. They still happy. Yeah. Material wise, they've got nothing money they've got nothing but they've got family so they've got everything yeah. and you know there's going to be people out there that says oh well it's all right for you to say that but it's true you know i'm not being flippant about it That's the That's the yeah so this is behind where we live look we're we're just like over there and then you've got all this land behind now these people they're not squatting they're actually paying rent we walk there because the other, the other way is a night it's a private yeah we could have walked around the roadway which is over there but we've come it's through here. yeah we're nearly into centro here you see can you remember that church on my last video we we're talking about it's here look <coughs> when we're on the uh in the for Jack going back to the shop and I said they're doing this church up well it's here look and they're doing it a bit of a bit at a time when uh, they get the donations from people that attend the church and this we actually went to a wedding here as well didn't we Mel yeah my cousin yeah your cousin's wedding What, babe? The road, the yeah, they're doing the road because there's an election coming up. <laughs> I'm only joking. Now they're doing the roads everywhere in the Philippines. It doesn't matter where you are. They're constantly trying to improve the place. And Naga, like I've said before, is so safe and so clean. You know, there's people that've got. Uh, these sweepers and they've got certain streets they've got to keep clean so if them streets aren't clean there's only those them to blame god i can't get any words out again um and i guess that's why the place is so good and this is a school a private school where kelly goes to And then if we turn right and go this way, LCC. we're at LCC. And you can get furniture and food, obviously food. 
everything you want. I know carnival there during the fiesta. Right? Yeah, there's a carnival. We've been we've been a couple of times and I've done videos on it and I didn't get many views. And this time the carnival's not that good. Not that it was good the last two times, but this time there's not a lot there, is there? Yeah. It's not very they have good. Also in SM carnival. Yeah. yeah. But that gets back to me saying there's always stuff going off in Naga and there is, there's always stuff going off. And this, this carnival, coming. yeah, the carnival always appears before the fiesta, doesn't it? Yeah. So we're looking forward to the fiesta, but Mel's probably going to be having the baby. <laughs> um, we're getting a bit concerned last night because you were having pains, weren't you? We thought the baby was coming. But uh, so far the pains have gone away and she's all right. So I was I was actually talking to my friend uh, Chris, who's uh, helping me with the website. Bless him. <laughs> it's just <laughs> it's like it's amazing, you know. I've not been much help to him telling him what I want and stuff like this, and he's going, "Oh, I can do that," and, that. and yeah, that's no problem. And it's like, my God, it's amazing. So, thanks very much Chris, I really appreciate it mate, and it's a lot easier to uh, convey that when I'm uh, actually on camera, or behind camera, than uh, doing it in texting. So guys, I'm hoping to have uh, an up upgraded, updated website that's going to be more user friendly etc, and more things for you to have a look at the horse and cart here <laughs> how much is it to three pesos I three think. pesos <laughs> bless them them horses they're, they're going to add it all day aren't they Mal yeah. in this heat because it's a bit overcast but it's really hot really hot and for the rainy season we've not had much rain just recently yeah. have we yeah but before it's very I know yeah. it's rainy eh? was it this shirt I had on when we did that that uh, video when I was overweight. No, the other. It wasn't this one. Uh. So I keep looking at this land, you know, this land's ideal for building on, but it's that close to Centro. It'd be yeah. a fortune. Yeah, it's a million. It's a million. It'll be more than that, baby. I reckon this would be something like 18, 20 million. It's been a long time. Now, At least. This land is like. Yeah. Land for some reason, and I'm not. And I know it's it's a city, and it get the land gets cheaper the further way out the city you go. But for some reason, Naga's very expensive compared to other places in the Philippines, and I can't understand why. If you if you if you, if, you, if it's near in city, it's a lot of money. But it looks like a province, it's not. Yeah, but there's other places, and this is just off the top of my head, guys, so don't uh, pin me down to it. But, you know, like Elo Elos and places like that, where similar um, places in the city or city surroundings isn't as expensive as Naga. But, um, obviously, I wouldn't want to live in them places anyway. I'm happy here because Nag is a great stepping stone to the whole of Bicol and you're 50 minutes away from the nearest beach you know so you got the best of a lot of worlds really aren't you? Yeah. This animal, I don't like uh, food, food bar there so if somebody wants to rent there Yeah, there's a new bar. food bar they've just knocked this building down and it looks like they're going to build a new building there there's a lot of building work going off like in Naga. Look, bed spacer room. Yeah. Yeah, bed, yeah, bed spacer. It's going to be rooms, look. Good park, park, good park. Good park there. If somebody wants to rent. Yeah, they're knocking all the old lean tos down and building proper buildings. So, another 10 years, you'll not know Naga because there's loads of building work going off. There's another, like, uh, Building, new building there, right? Mm, yeah. Like a mall? Mm. So I looked at me uh, 
videos obviously while I'm editing and the shaking's not too bad actually without the gimbal so I wouldn't buy another gimbal because they don't last I mean I was on my third gimbal the last a few months and then the rust and well you know the end result they just stopped working uh, that um, 3d printer I've got the nuts the bolts I've noticed are starting to rust around it so I've had to go and just clean them up a bit and put a bit of oil on them so that's the only thing I don't like about this this place is the uh, humidity it kills everything Yeah, um, there's one of our subscribers. The what? The shop over here. Let's have a look. This is where Mel buys most of her dresses from. Uh, now, the subscriber wanted us to, or rather, wanted Mel to take some uh, photographs of the dresses that she wears. and she's a little bit embarrassed to do it but this is the kind of stuff she buys look yeah and they're quite cheap aren't they Mel? 100 pesos I mean <laughs> that's crazy 100 pesos for a dress 80 80 pesos my god So there you go, that's, you can see the amount of dresses to choose from, bags, shoes, everything is cheap in this shop, tops, whatever you... <laughs> you're going to wear, you're going to wear sexier yeah. when you give birth. It's only, she's only wearing them because she's pregnant. <clears throat> She was looking at the legs of the day and saying, oh, my legs have got very big, but when I have the baby this time, I'm going to lose my weight and go back to being slim again. So, really? So that's what you'd like to do, is it? Go back to being slim. Make it be, make it make it weight I will be when I give birth I will lose weight right so that's what you'd like is it to get slim babe yes of course mm. I've been excited now yeah. so, especially I know I'm wearing a sexy yeah. wearing a sexy <laughs> <laughs> Searching for a longer day People feeling like the light has just come We must never stop the way Birds chirping and I hear my name Grasping into a life Life is happening 